I remember when I sat at my desk, unconcerned with the world, the value of X. There is no one size fits all when it comes to fixing back pain, but here's a few tips I've learned over the years. One of the big issues I see with a lot of people that have pain going into a squat is imbalances within their hips. For example, this athlete had a lot of internal rotation on one side and not a lot at the other that was leading to uneven forces at her low back. I showed her the hip airplane, dropping the pelvis into a good glute stretch 10 for 5 seconds and then always retest to check your work, great improvements. A proper back eval also exposes your individual triggers to help you know what you need to do to wind down your pain. For example, a seated compression test can let you know what specific postures may trigger your pain. For example, pulling up in a flex posture may let you know you need to, in the short term, decrease how often you round your back. Regardless, I often will use the McGill Big 3 as a part of a rehab program to enhance core stability and wind down pain.